on this problem, we get to learn some new vocabulary. First piece of vocabulary will be the degree. And the degree of a univariate polynomial will be, the, uni, the degree of a univariate polynomial is the highest exponent of all terms in the polynomial. Think of this as the number of copies of the particular variable, the number of copies of the variable. The leading coefficient, regardless of actual order of the terms in the polynomial, is the coefficient of the highest degree term. And again here, the order is irrelevant to the calculation or to the, uh, the solution of the leading coefficient. So let's try a handful of examples, or three examples here. I have three examples lined up on the left, and let's find the degree of each and the lead coefficient of each. Okay, remember the degree was the largest exponent that we see in the polynomial. So here in the first example we have 4u, technically to the power of 1, minus 7u, to the power of 2 minus 4u to the power of 7. So the exponents are the hidden 1, the number 2, and the number 7, and among these the largest would be the number 7. So the degree of this polynomial is 7. The leading coefficient, regardless of order, is to look at the term that had the degree of the large or the largest degree term. So here the largest degree term was the degree 7 term and its coefficient is the number negative 4. So the leading coefficient is the number negative 4. Okay. Pause for a second on the video if you'd like to try the next couple on your own. Assuming you took a shot out to try those. On the next one we have negative v to the fifth plus 5 with no copies of v, so we call that a zeroth degree term, minus v to the power of 4 minus 18v squared, in other words, to the power of 2. So among 2, 4, the hidden 0 here, no variable, and the number 5, the largest of these would be the number 5. Hence, that's the degree of the polynomial. Leading coefficient, find the degree 5 term, put a bubble around it if you wish, and the coefficient to this is a negative sign the way it looks, but remember there's a hidden 1 hidden right there, so this is really negative 1 times v to the fifth, and thus our leading coefficient is the number negative 1. Final example, in case you haven't already tried it, pause and try on your own. 7 plus 3x to the fourth minus 12x minus 9x cubed. Exponents, degrees, 3, the hidden 1, 4, and the hidden 0. The largest of 0, 4, 1, and 3 would be the number 4. So this is a degree 4 polynomial. And this time, the coefficient to the fourth degree term is the number positive 3. Typically, we don't write a plus along with it. We just say that the coefficient is a 